And now to better explain the environmental and social impact of the recently approved liquefied natural gas pipeline in British Columbia, we turn to Susan Kent, everybody. <laughs> Susan Kent. I know I was going to talk about the pipeline, and I started researching it on the net. Got that graphic and everything, but then I found this thing where you can see what song was number one on the day you were born, <laughs> and I kind of fell into a rabbit hole. What? But wait, this is going to be your big pipeline piece. You've been talking about it all week. I know, I know, but then I looked up the birthday for Ryan Gosling to see what his number one was, and guess what it is? No? Okay. <laughs> Barbara Streisand's Woman in Love. Crazy, right? Okay, wh what does this have to do? Then I looked into Prime Minister Justin Trudeau, and the number one during that period was Family Affair. Are you serious? What are the odds? <laughs> so you seem to have a problem with focus. Have you looked into Ritalin? Because and Hillary Clinton, what song was on America's lips when she was brought into the world? I don't know. Ain't talking about pipelines by the pipeliners. <laughs> It was actually a song called Near You by Frances Craig, a song about someone who just wants to be as close as possible to their lover. And if there's anyone that's keeping tabs on their lover, you best believe it's Hawkeye Hillary. <laughs> so there you have it. Pretty nuts, right? OK, well, now I want to know what was the song during your birthday. A little surfing tune by the Ventures called Pipeline. <laughs> Susan Kent, everybody. Susan Kent. <laughs> Don't miss all new 22 Minute Sketches. Subscribe to CBC Comedy now.